What's going on guys, Cosmic Sheen here, back again with a new video, uh, with a face cam video this time. You see this old, this real bland looking Windows 11 uh, UI. I still have an upgrade to Windows 10, uh, I don't really care to. Today we're going to be making our interface look Frutiger Arrow, if you know what I mean. I'm gonna be customizing it, making it look like it was a Windows Vista, Windows 7, you know, Frutiger Arrow type stuff. Uh, so the first step we're gonna go, we're gonna go to GitHub, we're gonna get the uh, open shell menu. Basically what this application lets you do is it lets you change the, um, the start menu. It makes you, it allows you to customize the start menu, make it look like however you want, and yeah, that's what you're gonna need this for. So you're gonna download that real quick. I just want to download that, install it. Okay, so once you eventually find it, um, took me a minute, I don't know why, it's gonna pop up here with all the different types of styles, and if you go to your little, um, start, start button menu, you see it'll pop up like this, um, Clearly not how the original Windows 7 one looked like, but it will look different. You can go to the old star menu, it's right here. But then again, if you just go here, it'll show up like this one. Oh my god, my neck hurts, bro. So yeah, this is right here, you got the classic style. Um, classic with two columns and the Windows 7 style. It's currently on the Windows 7 style, which I think I'm going to leave it on. We got... Whole bunch of other settings. So I want to change it to look kind of like blue, like how the actual Windows 7 looks like. So I'm gonna figure out how to do that real quick. I think it's a Windows Arrow. Okay, there we go. So now it's looking a little more Frutiger Arrow. You see what I mean? Okay, that's nice, so that makes it a little more, um, I don't even know what I was going to say. I think that's pretty good, honestly, um, I don't remember this looking like this, but I don't really know how to change that, so, well, I might just leave it like that, I'm going to be real. Alright, so next thing we're going to want to do is customize the, uh, the taskbar, because we're already almost there, basically, we already have this done, which is pretty easy. So next we're going to do the taskbar, we're going to want to download this little PNG right here, it'll basically change it from this kind of bland um, grayish color to this sort of glossy black color, so we're just going to download this. And while we're at it, I completely forgot, we might as well grab the OG Windows Vista wallpaper, like we can't forget this. Um, Okay, so I know this isn't the um, the OG Windows Vista wallpaper, but I kind of like this. I'm not, yeah, I kind of vibe with this. I'm gonna be real. So we might just keep this. Um, this is a little twist. I like this. All right, so once you get that, you're gonna want to go to the taskbar, customize taskbar settings, and you can see already. Once I click that, it sort of changed everything up. I'm gonna go. To, uh, um, I wanna say. Task bar. I actually don't know. Give me, give me like a second. Okay, there we go. Um, that doesn't look too nice. I low key, oh, okay, that doesn't look too nice either. I don't know if we have to change that up. Um, next thing you're gonna wanna do is download the Windows, the start button button. So you see how it looks like the bland Windows uh, 10 logo there? You wanna download the Windows Vista version, and we're gonna replace that. So you just go right here, replace start button, go custom, and then you can just pick the image, which we have right here. And it, ah! so there we go, we have it right there. 
This is looking great already, guys. We're, we're pretty much there, right? We're pretty much there. I'm a, I might put the other one. We're gonna see how that looks real quick. Come on, why? Every, everything's a fucking web file, bro. I, I hate these. They, they ruin everything. You go to download something, it's a web file. Can something just not be a web file for once? It's the same shit, bro. Yeah, you have to take a screenshot. I don't like taking screenshots. They piss me off. Okay. That looks pretty nice. That looks pretty nice. Alright, guys. So, we're like... What? 80% there right now? I'd say, like, one last thing we should do. You should download the Winero or Tweaker. Basically, what this lets you do is it lets you change little things within the system. Like, um... What I'm about to show you right now, the sound bar. So, if you click on it right now, it'll come up like this, the Windows 10 version. But if we download Winero Tweaker, Classic Volume Mixer. So if you click this, Enable Volume, it'll show up right there. Come on, guys. You can tweak it up and down. That's beautiful, is it not? Come on. Taskbar thumbnails. Uh, there's a lot of other stuff here, too, that I don't really want to mess with right now. But it's just, like I said, the small stuff that can get you just a step closer to making it look like a classic Windows Vista, Windows 7 type of thing, you know? Whoa. Oh, my fault. So, so, someone's calling me right now on my, um, on my, my phone, yeah. My, uh, Galaxy S3, guys, the newest phone that came out. You guys should have seen this. Um, this is the shit. Bro, this is my dad's phone from, like, 2011, bro. Look at this. You Look at, like, this thing's old, bro. It didn't even turn on, actually. I'm a little upset. I tried to charge it. It doesn't charge. It doesn't even turn on. I used to play hella games in here, bro. Does anyone remember, um, Granny Smith? Granny Smith, the game where you, like, you grab apples. And you had to, like, chase the guy. You had to chase the boy because he stole your apples. Granny Apple, I think that was the name, actually. That game was fire, bro. I used to play it all the time in this. Um, that, there was one zombie game. I don't even know what it was called. It was, like, you had to defend the tower before they all came. Alright guys, now that we got a computer looking pretty Windows 7, Windows Vista, what's a, what's a good Fruitica Arrow game we could play, um, right now? Uh, yeah, you guys like what I did? I, got, I even got the little Roblox, old school. I'm kidding, I did it a long time ago. Yeah, nobody cares. This is retro, guys. like nobody online. Two players. Let's go Rocket Arena. Let's see what that's all about. Yeah, that's crazy. We're actually in. So by the time this uploads, I don't... Who the fuck just killed me, bro? TikTok is probably unbanned, and, um... I'm gonna be real, I didn't even care for it. Um, I never had TikTok to begin with, so it was never really something that I cared about that much. But... The second I heard they were gonna start taking away CapCut, that was not part of the deal. And, um, yeah, we need to change something. That was not gonna slide with me. It's funny because literally, like, the band didn't even last the whole day. They, I think they took it back. And people are saying they got access to it again. So, that, it, it was just kinda dumb. Like, they banned it for two days. They, not, not two days. Why am I saying two days? They banned it for less than 24 hours. The app was just down. Like, can you even count this as a band? The app was just down. Like, it's funny too because I'm seeing on Instagram everyone's tweaking out. They're all posting on their stories. I, I counted like eight people all posting. Guys, TikTok's gone. No more TikTok. Only for it to come back like that. And no one's saying it. Like, everyone's like, oh my god, guys, TikTok's gone. Can this guy fucking die, bro? Why is it not? You got me. That's what I thought. Oh, that's what I thought. I'm the best at this game, bro. Don't, don't try me. Don't try me at Castle 
Battle Castle Crashers, alright. I almost killed myself. This wall doesn't even work, bro. Look, I'm putting it down. Oh, it does work. Oh, I think I had to mm, click it multiple times. It's probably not what it That's probably why I'm fucking it up. Yes, allow, please. Let me play. I was disconnected, are you serious, bro? So if you guys watch my older videos, you know already. I'll play this game like crazy. I just died. Um, I would use this in the background in a lot of my commentary videos. I don't think I have it anymore. I used to get I'm using a fucking pistol right now, so... Obviously something's wrong with me. Fuck, I didn't mean to do that. Hello. Where the fuck's my gun? I have my thing, bond, my key bonded to jump, because I'm trying to do a, a technique. I have it bonded to the, the scroll key, the scroll wheel, right? So every time I, I, I scroll down, and then I click, it goes on a separate weapon, and I'm We might just have to stick to the space bar, because this isn't going to cut out. Oh, we got a shotgun, guys. We might actually get a kill here. I'm not going to I'm going to get fucking dirty. Uh, excuse me? 